Shafiq, it's good to be with you today. Tell me a bit Thank more you. about yourself. Um, my full name is Muhammad Shafiq bin Burhanuddin. I'm 25 years old, uh, Malaysian, uh, Muslim, and I just graduated uh, from my degree in international business. Okay. Yes. And so uh, you work for Viva Palestina? Yes, yes. Tell I do. me more about their work. Uh, well, uh, what we do is uh, we mainly it's to to advocate for the Palestinian people. Okay. And also, other than that, we uh, we raise funds for the Palestinian people because uh, right now well, we need we need uh, to uh, channel some some funding to the Gaza people, especially in order for them uh, to sustain themselves because right now they are under siege, especially in Gaza. Uh, uh, after what the Israel uh, regime has done to them. And you're involved in the boycott, divestment sanctions as well? Yes, yes, the BDS. Uh, what we do is uh, we, we constantly uh, engage the public to boycott certain products that contribute to the Zionist regime. Uh, for example, right now we focus on four companies which are uh, McDonald's, Coca-Cola, uh, L'Oreal and Nestle. So I, I do hope that only, uh, Malaysians and also people all around the world, I think, uh, it's the same case. We, we should together boycott these companies. Because those companies are involved in the occupation? Yes, they are involved in the occupation and also these companies uh, 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 fund their, their, their channel, their, 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 profits. Their, their profits to uh, the Zionist agenda, you know, which is unjust, injustice for mm. the Palestinians. So we have to do something about yeah. this. And this week you've had a series of uh, lectures in universities yes. and on TV. Tell us more about that. Oh, this is brilliant. I mean, it's very good that uh, you, Reverend, and Professor Achin from India uh, to come all over here uh, to emphasize that this is not just a Muslim and Islamic issue, but this is a humanitarian crisis. And, and it's very important that we see this uh, in this perspective uh, in order to, to have justice for the Palestinian people. Yeah. What's been your highlight, do you think, this week? What have you been excited about? Well, to meet, to meet both of you, of course, because I think uh, I've never met uh, anyone who comes from this perspective. So it doesn't only open my eyes, and I think I can open other people's eyes with this. And I think uh, you, you've also been in the, in the two TV stations, two TV channels, which, which, uh, which reaches out to the entire Malaysians. And uh, I think that, that is brilliant. I think this is the way and forward. So what are your hopes for the future? I, I hope that the Palestinians will be liberated from the occupation right now, because this is clearly an injustice on the Palestinian people. So this is what we do as well in Palestine, to fight for their liberation and at the same time uh, to meet their needs, you know, uh, in any way we can. Yeah. Yes. And in terms of fighting, you mean non-violent ways of Absol resisting? Absolutely, uh, Stephen. In non-violent ways, uh, especially on BDS, boycott, div divestment and sanctions. So I would like to urge uh, everyone to contribute in any way they can financially or by simply by boycotting these yeah. products that I've that already mentioned. McDonald's, Coca-Cola, L'Oreal and Nestle. And so if people want to get involved in Viva Palestina, how do they do that? They can come uh, by to our website, okay? It's vivapalestina-my.org. I repeat, it's vivapalestina-my.org. Or they could uh, log on to Facebook and search Viva Palestina Malaysia or they could join any uh, the uh, international Viva Palestina uh, groups okay, in their respective countries because it's an international NGO. Shafiq, thank you very much. Thank you very much, Stephen.